Leader will become great not because of their power, but because of their ability to influence others, said John Maxwell. My name is Noor Azirha Binti Zamari, under the supervision of Ms. Asmahani Binti Mahdi and Madam Sarah Anacho, would like to present my research topic entitled The Relationship Between Leadership Style and Job Satisfaction Among Administrative Staff at State Human Resource Unit, Jabatan Ketua Menteri, Kuching, Sarawak. This is the research framework adapted from BAS 2008. There are two types of leadership involved towards job satisfaction. Transformational leadership moves followers to awareness about what is important and stay away from self-interest, while transactional leadership is more to using reward and punishment to motivate their employees. For example, if you don't do this for me, I will give you punishment. As for the problem statement, the reason why I conduct this study is because this research is limited in Malaysia. There are a few studies saying that transformational leadership effect more on job satisfaction and vice versa. This is the research objective and question where we want to find out whether these two type of leadership style have relationship with job satisfaction at State Human Resource Unit, Jabatan Ketua Menteri, Kuching, Sarawak. As for the methodology, correlational type of research is used for research design, list name of administrative staff for sampling frame, 189 administrative staff for population, online survey via Google form for sampling technique, validity of instrument, grandma check by Madam Saira, content validity checked by Dr. Ellen Chun, and fast validity done by two staff from State Human Resource Unit, Jabatan Ketua itself. For the reliability of instrument, the questionnaire are tested using pilot tests where 19 administrative staff are selected. And for the unit of analysis, 189 administrative staff from the State Human Resource Unit, Jabatan Ketua Menteri, Kuching, Sarawak. And this is the data collection procedure. As for the demographic data, most of the workers are female with the percentage of 61.6%. Most of the workers are aged above 40 years old with the percentage of 41.9% and the least is below 20 years old with the percentage of 3.5. Most of the workers are permanent workers with the percentage of 87.8% and for the highest qualification, diploma holders stated the highest percentage which is 29.7% and the least is STPM 7.6%. For the term of services, the highest is above 10 years with 51.2% and the least is below 2 years 11.0%. For the normality test, the result shows that data were normal since the value of skewness and kurtosis fulfill the assumption. And for the descriptive statistic, the mean statistic shows that most respondents strongly agree on leadership style. For the reliability task, all variables in the questionnaire are reliable. And for the correlational analysis, the result shows leadership style has a positive, strong and significant relationship with job satisfaction. The answer to our question is both leadership style have a strong, positive and significant relationship to a job satisfaction among the administrative staff of State Human Resource Unit, Jabatan Ketua Menteri, Kuching, Sarawak, supported by Two study from Daniel Martin and Kina Salim. As for conclusion, leadership style does have effect on job satisfaction in the State Human Resource Unit, Jabatan Ketua Menteri, Kuching, Sarawak. It can be summarized that leadership style has high level of strength, which is strong, positive, and significant correlation with job satisfaction. Last but not least, recommendation for the organization. Leaders should guide, motivate, and have a good relationship with their staff in order to compete with other organizations. For future researchers, they should conduct the study at private sector to get a different result and finding. For employee, employees should learn on how to create a good relationship with their leader and how to cooperate. This will help to improve their job satisfaction. That's all for me. Thank you.